In this video, Timmy's going to show you how to download multiple files at once from Google Drive without having to download each file one at a time. To do this, you need to select all the files that you want to download. And there's several different ways you can do this depending on how many files you want to download and what sort of order they're in. One option would be to hold down the control or command key on your keyboard depending on what operating system you use. And then just click on any file you want to select, and it will select them all like that. So as long as you're holding down that key, you can click on as many files as you want, and it will select them all. And it doesn't have to be in any particular order. So if you wanted to download this file and this file, and maybe one down here, and not these two, you can, that'll be fine. Or if you want to download a larger batch of files without clicking on each one, one at a time, you can click on the first one and then scroll down a bit to maybe here and hold down the shift key on your keyboard and then click on this one. And now the two files you clicked on and all of the files in between those files have all been selected. So if you want to select a large batch of files, that's probably the best way to do it. Or another option, if you want to just be really quick and easy, is you can actually just click and drag with your mouse and drag this little gray box across all the files you want to select, and it will select them all for you like that. So there's many different ways you can do it. And if you wanted to download all of the files in a specific folder, you could even just click on that folder to select that entire folder and download that folder and all the files inside it. And you could even hold down the control or command key and select multiple different folders if you wanted to really select a lot of stuff. But whatever you want to download and however you want to select it, you just need to go ahead and select everything you want to select. So for this tutorial, Timmy might just select these files here and quickly drag across them. So now we've selected these files here. And now once you've selected the files you want to download, you'll see this new bar will appear here and it says eight selected, but if you had selected 10 or something, it'd say 10 selected for you. And now all of these icons will perform actions for all the files you've selected. So you could share and delete them and lots of things like that. But one of these icons is the download button. So you can just go ahead and click the download button here to download all the files you've selected. But now, before the files start to download, you'll see this box in the bottom right hand corner that says preparing to download, zipping however many files. So what it's doing now is compressing all the files you selected into one zip file. And then it'll automatically download the zip file to your computer. And then you can extract all the individual files you selected back out of the zip file. It's a bit annoying that you have to wait for it to zip up the files. And then you have to take the files out of the zip file once it's downloaded. But that's the way it always works when you want to download multiple files from a website all at once. And there's really not any way you can get around that. So you just need to wait for it to finish zipping all these files into one zip file. If you've selected lots and lots of files, this could take quite a while, but hopefully it won't take too long. And now, once it's done zipping, the file should automatically start downloading to the downloads folder on your computer. And the download progress might look a bit different depending on what browser you use but you should see the progress somewhere on the screen while the zip file is downloading. And then once it finishes, a zip file containing all the Google Drive files you selected will now be downloaded to the downloads folder on your computer. So once it's downloaded, we'll just wait for this to finish here. Once it's downloaded like this, we'll just go ahead and open up the files app and come into the downloads folder. And now we'll see this drive download zip file here. So we now have the zip file. And if you already know how to open a zip file on your computer, you can go ahead and open it up and get the files out of it. But 
If you don't know how to open a zip file, this process is a bit different depending on what computer you have. So Timmy's actually put links to specific tutorials on how to open a zip file on each different operating system in the description below. So you can go and watch one of those videos for your specific computer and then extract your files out of the zip file. And then you'll have all of those files you selected downloaded in your computer in the downloads folder and extracted from the zip file. And that's all there is to it. If you're just downloading two or three files from Google Drive, it might actually be slightly easier to download them one, one at a time because then you don't have to extract them from the zip file afterwards or anything like that. But if you want to download a large bunch of files all at once, this can still end up being a lot quicker and easier. Once you get the hang of working with zip files, it's really not bad. Or if you want to download absolutely all of your files from Google Drive, there is also a different way you can do that using something called Google Takeout, which allows you to download all your files in just a few clicks without having to select them all in Google Drive. But this video is already quite long, so Timmy actually has a separate video about that that you can go and watch here. That video is about downloading the files to an external hard drive like this, but you can just download them directly to your computer if you want to, and it will still be basically the same process. So go and watch that video if you want to do that. But if you didn't want to do that and you just wanted to download some like Timmy showed you in this video, you're all done. So Timmy will see you in another one soon.